Hi there. Now for this next question then, we were given that y equal 4x cubed minus 5 all over x squared, x not equaling 0. And in the first part, a, we're asked to find dy by dx and given it its simplest form. You could have 12x squared plus 10x to the power minus 3, but I prefer to think of it in its simplest form as 12x squared plus 10 over x cubed. And in part b, you had to find the integral of y with respect to x, and giving that in its simplest form is going to be x to the power 4 plus 5 over x plus c, c being a constant of integration. This was, in my opinion, a fairly straightforward question. Just when it comes to differentiating here, remember this is minus 5 times 1 over x squared. 1 over x squared is x to the power minus 2. And so when you differentiate, just multiply the power with the number at the front. So you've got 3 times 4 here, which is the 12, and then you reduce the power by 1. So you've got 12x squared. Similarly, with 5x to the minus 2, or I should say minus 5x to the minus 2, minus 2 times minus 5 is plus 10. Take away 1 from the power gives us minus 3. So you've got plus 10x to the minus 3 x to the power minus 3, remember, is 1 over x cubed. So that's going to give me 10 times 1 over x cubed is 10 over x cubed. As for the integral, don't forget to put brackets, by the way, around your two terms here, because you have got more than one term. And then integrating, all you do is add 1 to the power. So in this case, for x cubed, that's x to the power 4, and divide by the new power. So you divide by 4. For minus 5x to the minus 2, add 1 to the power. That's going to be minus 1. And divide by the new power, minus 1. So minus 5 divided by minus 1 is plus, And x to the power minus 1, well, that's 1 over x. So you end up with 5 over x, OK? On the first term here, the 4s cancel, just leaving you with x to the power 4. OK, so I hope that's helped if there were any problems.